Hello everyone and today's topic is while loop, for loop and pattern examples. Go to text editor, loop statements, for loop. For loop in python is used to iterate over a sequence, say list, tuple and string. These are the data types in python, we shall discuss about them in detail in coming sessions. Syntax of for loop, for is a keyword, space, a variable to hold this space in, in is a keyword, space, a sequence and a colon followed by statements of for this for loop. Go to the interactive shell, say for, for is a keyword and i is a variable here and in is a keyword. Sequence can be a list, triple and index, sorry, string. So we, we shall have a list here, list consists of items like 1, 2, 3, 4, colon, enter, say print, i. So at first instance, 1 will be there in i. The next next time when it iterate 2 next time when it iterate i will hold 3 the next time it will iterate i will hold 4 so when i when you print i it should it will print 1 2 3 4 at new lines you can see here at the terminal the print we, we got output like 1, 2, 3, 4. Let's go to the text editor. These are few examples for for loop. Here words is a list containing of strings as an items. Just copy this. Say for i in words. Here words is a sequence consisting of items like cat, window, defense set as a sequence, colon, print, i. It will print cat, window, defense rate. Similarly, take one more example. It will print one space four space new line seven new line three new line eight. If you want to print the items in the same line, we have to give end. Say take nums is equal to say for i in nums colon print i comma separator is equal to comma and end is a tab you can see here one a tab four tab seven tab three tab eight by default if we, we haven't specified any and a new line character is printed we shall discuss about it in detail in the coming sessions coming to for loop for can also iterate through a string sequence i n say name colon enter print i go to interactive shell say for i n you a string say name colon enter print i so here name string becomes a sequence, sequence of characters. 
so it will print n new line character a new line m new line e you can see here n new line a new line m new line e for the for loop we can also give range for i in range of 4 say print i you can see here as range starts with 0 and ends with 3 so i becomes 0 1 2 3 it will iterate through 0 1 2 3 take one more example say fruits is equal to apple banana and mango for i in fruits colon print i it, it will iterate each and every item of a list apple banana and mango we can also use range for that for i in range of length of fruits so it will length of fruits will return 3 length of this list is 3 so it will return 3 so print i if you try to print this the output will be 0 1 2 but i want the items inside the list so i of say fruits fruits of i you can see apple banana mango we are trying to index here we shall discuss about this indexing and slicing in coming topics on list data structure for loop also has an else block say i in in say name colon enter print I for loop also has a else block so else colon enter print inside else block you can see here for i in name so we should get n new line character a new line m new line e and after that else is executed when people come from java c plus or c they tell like it should throw an error because misplaced else here in python this is a valid statement so for loop has an else block so after the iteration is done it will execute this else block what is the significance of else block here I will explain that after some time we can also have nested for loop say for inside of for for i in range of 5 colon for j in range 2 say print i comma j you can see here remember the indentation at the first iteration i 
I will be looped twice because the range of j is 2 so 0 0 the next iteration of j 0 1 it will go to the top layer of i so the next iteration i becomes 1 so 1 0 and 1 1 the next iteration i becomes 2 and so on and coming to while loop while loop syntax while space expression to be resolved like true or false and for followed by colon enter and statements say go to the interactive shell say take a variable a is equal to 10 while a less than 20 sorry less than 20 colon say print a always increment a is equal to a plus 1 you can see here 10 11 12 13 and so on up to 19 let's try to do another example open a fresh instance of interactive shell say for i n range of 6 colon say for i n range of for j in range of i colon print star comma and is equal to a space and there is some issue so let's try to redo that star should be in quotes say print new line you can see here this is one of the pattern take this code and try to analyze this code open the text editor you can see here at first time i becomes 0 so this loop is not executed it will print a new line and come out so at the next instance i becomes 1 next iteration i becomes 1 so for j in 1 so it will iterate once so it will print star and with space and come out so at the first iteration and when i is equal to 1 i is equal to 1 it will print star the next iteration i becomes 2 so for j in range of 2 so this loop iterates twice so it will print star space star the next iteration i becomes 3 so this loop iterates thrice 0 1 2 so it will print star space star space star this space is due to the end 
end argument in print function. And every break, break of this for loop prints a new line. So when i becomes 4, it will iterate the inner loop iterates four times say star space star space star space star enter i becomes five it will iterate five times the inner loop so it becomes star space star space star space star space star can also do the same thing with numbers try to print i sorry j here you can see here 0 0 1 0 1 2 0 1 2 3 0 1 2 3 4 and now coming to loop control statements in python loop control statements in python are break and continue let's go to the python interactive shell say for i n take a string called break of india colon print i if i is equal to is equal to we are validating with the character say d colon break so when i becomes equals to character d this entire loop breaks so it should it will print only i n in this case i n d in this case so at first iteration i becomes i so it will print i and the next iteration it will becomes n so it will print n so i is not equal to n so it won't break and the next iteration it will print d and i is equal to t so it, this condition satisfied and this and this break statement executed so this break statement makes the code co makes the loop break and come out of this loop so the output is i and d similarly we also have a continue statement say for i n i n such in colon print i if i equal to say character h continue you can see here so the control statement the continue statement makes the loop go to the starting of the loop we shall take another example which makes clear understanding of this continue control flow statement say for i in say such in colon if i equal to h continue point i 
can see here it did not print h because at the first iteration i becomes s so this block is not executed so it printed the next iteration i becomes a this block is also not satisfied so it will print a in the next iteration i become c so it won't it, so it will print c so at the next iteration i becomes h so this block executes and continue it will go to the starting of the for loop so it won't this print this print statement won't execute when i becomes h this is the continue control flow statement there is, similarly there is one more control statement control flow statement say pass just open the fresh instance say for i n say messy colon pass and try to print i it return me character i here pass does nothing it's a null here it's the for loop goes on iterates and i is assigned to the variable i here take another example for pass say ronaldo Let's try to print i it printed o so it goes on iterates as pass is pass is now so i becomes o and this loop terminates and the next topic is for else loop for item in container or sequence if if block where we have a break statement and else and this else belongs to this for loop so in the else block we have some statements so common construct is to run a loop and search for an item if an item is found we break out of the loop using break statement so we are searching for an item if the item found we break out of this for loop so this else part is not executed when the item is found there is another case when the item is not found this else loop is executed because this break in this break we are not coming out of this for loop the first one is when when item is found the break is encountered so the else block is not executed the second scenario when the loop ends without encountering the break statement the else block executes take an example for for else block say for i in range of 10 print i if i equal to 5 break else print i value of i at the end of end of for loop can see here the output of this for loop is 0 1 2 3 4 5 because when an i becomes 5 this break statement executed and this entire loop got broke down similarly try to do the same thing try to validate it with 11 
say I try to validate I with 12 you can see here so I iterated through each and every item in the list 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and this else block is executed because this condition never satisfied and this break is not executed so value of i at the end of for loop is 9 similarly take one more example for for else block say for n in range of 2 to 10 for x in range of 2 to n so this for loop will execute from 2 to the value of n so try to execute this try to run this example at the drag to shell it will give me the prime numbers ranging from 2 to 10 you can see here 2 is a prime number 3 is a prime number and 4 equals to 2 into 2 5 is a prime number and 6 equals to 2 into 3 and 7 is a prime number 8 equals to 2 into 4 and 9 equals to 3 into 3 let's have some explanation of this nested for loop say at first iteration iteration 1 and becomes 2 and is equal to 2 comma so range of 2 comma 2 it returns me an empty list so we have a point here let's go to the interactive shell so that I can show you live for i in range of 2 to 2 2 comma 2 it will return me an empty list say try to print i and also have else block say print inside inside else block else loop else block I will else will be printed printed when loop when the sequence is empty as well is empty you can see here here range 2 of 2 becomes an empty list even though it is an empty list else block is executed so coming to this example here range of 2 to 2 returns an empty list and else block is executed so when at first iteration n is equal to 2 it will print 2 is a prime number the next iteration 2 where n becomes 3 so the next inside loop becomes for x in range of 2 to 3 so x becomes 2 2 here so 3 modulus 2 not equal to 0 so this if block won't be executed so it will go to the else so 3 is a prime number it will print 3 is a prime number similarly for the next iteration n becomes 4 it will loop from 2 to 3 and the iterations goes on let's have some few tasks on pattern programming let's say task 1 task 1 is to generate a pattern with below 
using for loop. See, the requirement is to generate this pattern. At the first line, it should print 1. In the next line, it should print 2-2. Two, two. In the next third line, it should print 3-3. Three, three. The fourth line, 4-4 four, four, and so on up to 9. You can see here, it's the length is 9. The size of this pattern is 9. So, it should const the base for loop should loop 9 times. So, for i in Let's declare one variable called size. Size is equal to 9 for i n range of size colon enter. The next loop, the next loop, you can see here at the first iteration it should print one so it should only loop once so for j in range of i print i comma it should end with space and and this for loop should end with new line character say print new line try to save it and run open the command prompt go to the examples copy this path go to the command prompt cd that path enter clear screen python space pattern 1.py you can see here pattern we got a pattern but it executed only eight times you can change the size here say size plus one should print till nine i will explain it later you can see here it printed nine times because range of 9 use 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So we have to increment with 1. So now the range of 10 use 0 to 9. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 up to 9. Since range of 0 gives me empty list, this won't be executed. Or we can also start with range of 1 to size of 1. go to the terminal say range of 0 list of to print the list 0 will give me an empty list go to another task where task 2 says generate a pattern below using a for loop we need to generate a pyramid full pyramid using for loop can specify the size size is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 enter and you can see here the spaces for the first iteration for this, we need to declare one more variable called spaces is equal to at the first time it will become 2 into size 1, 2, 3 
and 2 into size minus 1 so 2 into size minus 1 and the next iteration at 2 it should become minus 1 so at the top only two spaces are printed start the for loop for i in range of size colon for j in range of m so spaces to print the spaces here colon for this loop it should print spaces so print and is equal to space and the spaces should be decremented minus one for the next iteration so spaces is equal to spaces minus one the next loop is to print this star say for k in range of i plus 1 say print star comma and with space after end of this loop we need to print new line say print slash n Try to print this clear screen python space python 2 dot py you can see here a full pyramid is printed similarly 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 the size is 7 Similarly, go to another task. Task says generate a pattern below using a for loop. The task is to generate a half pyramid. So, in this pattern, we need to remove this part. Declare the size. Size is equal to say 7. Or else, or else we can also take it from the input take it from the input say int input enter the size enter the size of the pattern size of the pattern for i in I in range of size for J in range of I plus one. Print 
star comma and argument should be space the new line character print new line save it and run it go to the command line clear screen python space pattern 3 dot py size of the pattern say 7 you can see here half pyramid is at the terminal 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 similarly clear screen try to give some other size say 12 you can see here half pyramid with size 12 is at the terminal And this completes our pattern programming and today's topic of while loop, for loop and pattern examples. Thank you.